Hello everyone, this is Marino Ingeniero and welcome to my channel. Today's topic is about overhauling of fuel injection valve and how to calibrate it. Let's go! Fuel injection valve is commonly found on diesel engines and it is a very basic part of a diesel engine. But what will happen if the fuel injectors are dirty or not maintained from its top condition? The answer is that it may cause your engine to misfire. The engine may stop and it leads your vessel to power blackout. But don't worry. That will be a rare case because maintenance of fuel injectors on board is a basic maintenance. Watch this video and it may give you an idea on how to maintain your fuel injectors from its top condition. Before you start dismantling your fuel oil injector, try to pressure test first to confirm if the nozzle is still good to reuse. Remove the old o-rings and clean the grooves. Remove the retainer, then remove the copper spacer by hammering it with a flat screw from its thick edge. Loosen the lock nut and adjusting nut first before you loosen the nozzle nut because the spring is pushing the nozzle and it's hard to loosen the nozzle nut. Or else the thread will be damaged and I hope you have a spare holder. Now you can loosen the nozzle nut. Disassemble all the parts and soak it with clean kerosene, gasoline, or diesel. Even better if you soak with carbon remover or Cresol stock solution. Fuel injection valve is removed, inspected, cleaned, and adjusted every 1,500 to 2,000 running hours as per manufacturer's instruction on the manual. The parts are cleaned and now you are ready to reassemble it again. Put back the lock nut. The adjusting nut, the plane washer, the guide, put the retainer, confirm that the guide will not move, put back the spring, squeeze some oil on the spring, put back the seat, the parallel pins, the spacer, Another parallel pins. Inspect the nozzle and jerk the needle even if it is new. Confirm that the needle is moving smoothly. Put the nozzle on top of the spacer but make sure that the oil hole is aligned. Lastly, screw back the nozzle nut and tighten with a torque of 300 to 320 newton meters. Start to calibrate the new overhauled injection valve by adjusting the adjusting nut until it reaches the opening pressure of 45 plus minus 0.5 MPa. Here is the example of purely atomized diesel with a newly installed nozzle. After the opening pressure, observe the pressure drop. If it is too fast, Look into the nozzle tip if the diesel is leaking rapidly. The nozzle should be replaced. Try also to touch the nozzle tip. If it is too wet, the nozzle should be replaced. Bear in mind not to put your hand inside the cubicle during atomization. It causes serious injury. If the opening pressure is reached, tighten the lock nut if you are satisfied with your adjustment. Pressure test for the last time to confirm the opening pressure is right. Please take note that the average life of a nozzle is up to 2,500 running hours only. That's all for today's topic about overhauling a fuel injection bulb and calibrating it. I hope you like my video. If yes, please like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Have a safe voyage. See you in my next vlog. Bye!